Hey, Instagram. It's me, T, from the Pattersons, taking the train to the bed. Yes, it's a Thursday, which means it's audio drama day. It also means that I leave from the Baza and end up in Kubebo, which I'm in Kubebo right now. Uh, the only good thing, not the only, there's a lot of good things about Kubebo. I'm told I can't mention the really good thing about Kubebo, which is uh, my wife is here, but I can't mention her. She said, stop mentioning her on social media, so I'm not going to mention her. Anyway. And one of the things when I come to Gubebo, see, when I'm in Dubaza, I don't alter my state enough like I can't drink and stuff like that. But when I'm in Gubebo, I just found out that the, the Checkers Liquor, one or whatever, I found this out last, last week, that they actually have Guinness. I don't really drink, you know, whatever, but they have Guinness. And much more, they have Guinness Draft Stout, which is what I actually, well, I'm not advertising, actually what I drink. I mean, you know, the, 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 um, John McDonough, you know, the cabbie, notwithstanding. I'm just saying, this is my beer of choice. <laughs> uh, now they got anything. So I, I buy in the cans. I go back on Monday. So those are the four, the four cans of Guinness. See, see I'm, a, I'm a responsible drinker. Even though the, right on the side of this big can says, alcohol reduces driving ability. Do not drink and drive. Well, we take public transportation here. Public transportation means taxes. But there's audio dominate, so we have to talk about audio dominate. Now, now, you know, radio is that's like well, a, a little more than 100 years old. And audio drama comes from radio oh, Radio drama. You know, when I first started audio drama, it was radio drama. I, actually, I started calling audio drama before a whole lot of people called audio drama. Because I, I, I was a, I was a, what was I? I mean, I'm a radio person, but uh, I'm a recordist. So audio is, means, means, means a lot to me. Anyway, so... Uh, so I started calling it audio drama. But here's the thing. When I was doing radio drama, I started with people saying, oh, radio drama, that's dead, that's all of it. I said, are you crazy? I didn't say, oh, you're crazy. I said, no, you don't understand. Radio drama is always with you. If you look at any advertisement, you turn off your t turn the sound, turn the, turn the picture off your TV, that's radio drama. Da da <laughs> you know. Uh, I remember, uh, who was it, Spike Lee? No, or maybe it was, uh, or dare I say, I think it was P. Diddy. <laughs> That said, he looks. He look. He, he looks for audio. You know, audio sample, um, um, sound effects and stuff like that. Because audio drama is driven by sound effects. Like every 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 genre has their has their main person, their star, whatever it is. And uh, with, audio, with, with radio drama, audio drama is actually the sound effects is the is the star. You know. And uh, I, I would go into the history or whatever because there was this woman that, that did the sound effects. And I won't get into. I'll get to some other time. Another time. Keep on going with this one. Uh, so. And first, the first black uh, a radio drama person with sound effects. Well, anyway, don't, don't worry about him either. The point is this: uh, it never leaves, right? Um, if, if you look at uh, authentic jazz, but what you realize with all those all those cartoons that you grew up with, whatever they use, they use jazz. You know, they they use they use jazz as 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 the uh, as a sound effect. and sound effects. What well, the first sound effects is what is it? Is a drummer going? Somebody trips on the stage. You know, so those sound effects. Okay. Now, I used to do this thing. Well, I like the ball. I used to do this thing uh, because I was in a position to do it. Uh, these are uh, 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 what are called 24 hour conclaves. And then the 24 hour conclave, it starts, it starts at 4 o'clock in the afternoon. We go the whole go 24 hours. And we present, we, they, they, we do workshops and the sound effects and music, and they work on their scripts. And uh, we show films like, like for instance, uh, the. the the the, the uh, radio drama yeah the radio drama film that I really love is uh, it's a Japanese film called uh, uh, Welcome Back Mr. Mc, Mr. McDonald it's a great film it's funny it's great right? I, I think I have two copies right uh, uh, and it's really a good film but there's all kinds of films like for instance since I mentioned P Diddy let me mention somebody else that's on the outs with, with people like that one of the greatest radio drama or, or audio dramas if you, you you if you care is is uh, 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 with out of the closet, you know, uh, the R. Kelly thing. It's it's amazing. It's, it's so I, 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 I bring this up to say that it never leaves. You know, audio drama is spectacular. Let's put it that way. What's more important about audio drama? You can put everything that you want in an audio drama, and you can do it instantaneously. Like, in fact, since we talk about these kind of things, it's political season. When Barack Obama was running in, in uh, 2007, Whatever it is when he first first started, right? I was scheduled to do a, 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 
scheduling to do an audio drama workshop in, uh, I think it was Mississippi. I think it was Mississippi. Uh, around about the time we first announced it, people were gearing up, whatever. Have you. And, you know, these, these uh, well, I, won't, I won't name names, but these people uh, uh, down there, they said, oh, no, no, we can't do that. We, it's too important. We got to, you know, basically work for Barack Obama. I understand that. But what they didn't understand, if they did, if did the workshop, I could give them ways to put to that, that message in other ways. They was going to do the regular Democrat Party thing. You know what I mean? So I can use, you can use audio drama to make it more entertaining, uh, make, it, make it memorable, blah, 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 blah. blah. But they weren't, they weren't hearing that. And they just marginalized me right away. Boom, get out of here with that. <laughs> oh, boy, people just don't know. So my point is this. Audio drama, you, you can, it, it, because uh, it's audio, you know, like, like, like right now I have a face for radio because of the Bell's palsy came upon me and blah, 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 blah. But, but my voice remains, as I got my voice back, that's all right. my voice remains. So it's really just your voice and, 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 and your script and your, your message, your voice and your message. That's all uh, audio drama is, you see? And so in that sense, I mean, you could be, you could be a, a, a four foot ogre and play, and play the leading character. You see what I'm saying? So it doesn't matter how you look, it matter how you how you articulate. <laughs> so so that's audio drama in a nutshell. That's why I love it so much. It's a, it's a real talk about politics. It's a real democratic form. It's pure democracy. You can be anything and anybody and be and do audio drama. This is why I sell whatever. And plus it's therapeutic, you know, because when you're writing stuff like that, you can get stuff off, you know, you can get stuff out of your, out of your you know, and and you can use it as you can weaponize it. Da, 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 da. It's therapy. I've been in so many situations where it's unbelievable. I mean, I, I did a workshop in, in Montreal, not, yeah, Montreal, Canada, and at the end, people had to write down da da da. da. And believe it or not, one of the people said, you know, I was, I was, before this workshop came, I was, I was going to commit suicide, but because of the workshop, it opened me up. So, it kind of, I'm just trying to say that audio drama is the bee's knees. So just. I want you to know that. Okay? Talk to you all later.